What has allowed men to build hundred-story skyscrapers? What makes up the whole of massive aircraft carriers and suspends the Golden Gate Bridge above the San Francisco Bay? Steel. With the addition of about 1% carbon in iron, a harder, stronger material is produced. Adding small amounts of other alloying elements such as chromium serves to improve the mechanical properties of steel even more while also improving its ability to prevent rust. Grades of steel that exhibit this resistance to corrosion are referred to as stainless steels and are used extensively in applications ranging from kitchen utensils to armored tanks. Two processes are used to produce the majority of steel in the world. The first process uses a blast furnace where fuel, iron ore, and a flux are continuously supplied through the top of a furnace while oxygen is blown through the bottom, giving it the name basic oxygen steel making. A series of exothermic chemical reactions occur to melt the steel down to a liquid bath. Molten steel and slag are then tapped out of the bottom of the furnace while the off gases exit from the top. A typical blast furnace can produce more than 5,000 tons per day. A more modern approach has been developed that boasts much higher efficiency, flexibility, and environmental friendliness. The electric arc furnace is capable of melting down scrap steel from recycled automobiles and other manufactured products in much smaller quantities than blast furnaces. The smaller furnaces and the batches they produce increase the flexibility of the mill and reduce cost and lead times necessary to compete in today's market. A major challenge to the steel industry today is the minimization of waste products including heat, electricity, and gases. By reducing waste, steel producers can make cleaner products which are less damaging to the environment and lower in cost. In fact, more than 80 million tons of steel are recycled every year in North America alone. Steel mills have implemented systems to trap and filter the off-gases to prevent greenhouse emissions. Improved slag practices have increased energy efficiency. Other areas such as waste production, dust, and even sound levels have been reduced dramatically in order to improve the environment surrounding steel plants. While maximizing production and profitability is an important part of any industry, there is one thing that remains paramount. Safety is the top priority for steel mills and is taken very seriously, appropriate for an industry that deals with materials over 3,000 degrees Fahrenheit. Through continuous research and innovation, steel making is an ever-evolving effort to improve every aspect of the industry to produce stronger products at lower cost with cleaner technologies that impact our everyday lives.